some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Washington State with the Siberian Tiger as he uh, happens across a uh, scene where somebody has been arrested and, uh, well, they're in the middle of the inventory search at this particular moment. And he just so happens to, well, desire a conflict and uh, starts an argument with the police officers who are more than patient and could have taken him in. But alas, I mean, he got off this time because the police saw how much of a mental disorder this guy was. So they decided to cut him a break. But let's just go ahead and sit back, relax, and watch this idiot make a total fool out of himself. Okay, what we have here is uh, the end of a traffic stop, pretty much. The uh, suspect has already been arrested, and, uh, well, there was apparently something in his uh, prison suitcase, which is a term that a lot of prisoners use for, uh, well, something being shoved up your, uh, well, rectum. Oh, oh, God! Why didn't anybody tell me? Ah! Hey, you can go over there and record, but not right here. Okay. Who are you? I'm the I'm law enforcement. I'm the police here. Okay. So you can go over there right. and record, but not right here. I asked you who are you. Okay. I'm telling you, I'll talk to you over there. Identify yourself. You can see my name right here. You can read. Go that way, please. Badge okay. number? We don't have badges. Okay. ID number? Okay. Employee number? Let's go over there and I'll talk to you. Why? Because you, you this is our this is our scene. Okay. You're interrupting our scene because we don't know who you are. How? We don't know who you are. How am I interrupting? If you're going to obstruct, continue. I'll take you to jail. I'll how, arrest you. How am I obstructing? Because well, gee, let me think, Mr. Siberian Tiger. Uh, yeah, it appears that you probably are obstructing uh, the law enforcement officers here because you are taking their attention away from their scene by uh, acting as belligerently as you are. And according to uh, uh, the revised code uh, 9A, Point seven six point zero two zero obstruction of a law enforcement officer. A person is guilty of obstructing a law enforcement officer if the person willing willingfully hinders, delays, or obstructs any law enforcement officer in the discharge of his or her official powers or duties. And at this moment, they have to do a risk assessment of the scene because of your sorry ass because they don't know what you're up to. Hell, you could. Uh, be here to, uh, well, off one of the cops for all they know. I mean, stranger things have happened. But you fraud a charge here and they say, Oh, I'm no threat. I'm no threat. Well, how do they know that, dipshit? In the middle, middle of the investigation, okay. and we don't know who you are. You can be, you can be standing here with weapons. We don't know. You see any weapons? I don't see, I don't know. You can conceal. I don't know. You see any weapons? I don't know you, okay? I'm asking you politely. You can record all day okay. long, all you want from over Let's there. Let's get something straight. Okay. I was standing, no. I was standing on the sidewalk. Sir, walk. sir. You Please came around the car. Sir, please go over there. You you are right now harassing me. No. Ah, you're harassing us, actually. You're right now approaching no. me. Yeah, I am approaching you yeah. because you're making our scene unsafe. How? Okay, because we don't know who you are. So what? You don't okay. know who that guy is. Okay. Can you tell him to move? He's across the street. He's right? Not, he's not in our scene. So? Okay, you're in our scene right now. Are you the supervisor? Okay. No, I'm not. Tough guy, Wait. get back to your job. I am doing my Shut job. Shut up. Hey. Mind your business. I I'm standing on a public okay, sidewalk. Sure. And if you're gonna approach me, okay. I'm gonna consider you a threat. Okay. I'm, you're, you're. You got a problem? I will consider you to be a threat. Oh, you. Oh, okay. Well, this brainless fraudatard is gonna try to take it to a whole new level. He's trying to threaten this police officer at this very moment. So why don't you take it a little bit further and actually follow through with your threat and see how far that gets you, you dumbass. Yeah, I'm sure the, you'll look good in a shiny new pair of bracelets as they uh, charge you with assault on a police officer. And then you can show uh, the uh, judge the bravado you had 
with the police officer by demonstrating it on him and see, well, how much of a sentence you get after that. One of these days, you're going to F around and find out with the wrong officer, and he's going to put you in a pair of silver bracelets for this kind of thing. But right now, this tyrannical officer right here is doing the best he can to deal with a rather belligerent asshole. What are you harassing me? No, I'm not. I will defend myself. No, I'm not. Do you know what the state... Do you know what state we're in? Yes, we're in the state of Washington. Exactly. Go over there, please. So if I'm not breaking in your laws, you are and I'm the law. simply was standing here, okay. and you approached me, and you're you harassing me, here, your ass better get the hell out of out of here. Got it? No. You can walk no. over there. No. Get your supervisor. Who's your supervisor? Who's the supervisor on scene? Going. Keep going. Who's the supervisor on scene? Keep going over there, please. Your ass better back up. Your ass better back up. Go over there, please. Your ass better back up. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. I'm a free man. I was walking freely. I'm standing on the sidewalk. Yeah, I was can. not doing anything. And my freedom of speech is not interfering, dumbass. Not, it's not your freedom of speech. No. What is it then? What okay. am I doing? Okay. Am I blocking you? Am I physically doing anything? Your ass came over here and bothered me. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> Oh, really? Uh, asking you to step a couple feet in the other, other direction is uh, harassing you. Uh, yeah, that's a load of bullshit. I mean, first of all, he never asked you to stop filming. He really just asked you to step aside so they could have the uh, scene a bit more secure. Because, you know, uh, well, they don't know who the hell you are, dude. And at this moment... You are uh, on, in danger of getting arrested of, for obstructing and, uh, well, potentially threatening a police officer. So, yeah, you're not exactly winning any brownie points with these guys at this, at this time. And your civil rights have not been violated. That's just something all cooked up in your head because you want to believe that you're being persecuted when you are not. I mean, simple as that. And threaten me. I'm not threatening anything. Yeah, you just threatened to arrest me for obstruction. Okay, because you are obstructing. How? Because you're hindering our investigation. How? We're stopping this to deal with you. How? Your ass came over to talk to me. Exactly. Why? Because you're hindering our investigation. How? Because we don't know who you are. You're stupid. Okay. That is, learn the law, dumbass. Okay. That's why I'm raising my voice. I'm sick and tired of punks like you, okay. tyrants like you, okay. harassing law abiding okay. citizens. Okay. Piss off. Okay. Got it? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. See, you stupid like morons. Stand in the room. Oh, I'm going to arrest you for trespassing. Or I'm going to arrest you for hindering. Or I'm going to arrest you for interfering. How am I interfering? Articulate it. I'm waiting. I've explained it to you. Articulate it. Standing on the sidewalk, exercising my constitutional rights, is hindering your investigation. What, is, what, is, what, what you're doing what here, your here's what you're doing. When you're blocking what my camera, the, is, when you're blocking my camera, you're interfering with me. You're interfering with my First Amendment. You're well, by that extraordinary logic, uh, the police would always be obstructing you because they would always be in the way, even if they were ignoring you and going about their regular duties at this scene. I mean, good freaking grief, they would block some part of your camera. I mean, yeah, great logic right there, dude. Violating federal law. That's prior there. restraint. Federal law. Federal violation. Prior restraint. Violation of my constitutional rights. Kiss my ass. Go ahead and arrest You're me. You're not a very nice person. I don't give a damn what you think about me. Okay, You're, a You're a tyrant. You're a tyrant. C-H-N tyrant. Okay. Got it? Sure. That's right. Okay. Sure, 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 yeah. sure. That's sure. all you can do. So all you can do is harass people. What's going on here? You don't need to know that. Yeah, I do. What's that? Okay. Yeah? Identify yourself. Okay. I'm a police officer. Please. I know you're a police officer. I can see police. I said identify yourself. It's right here. It's on my desk. Is that your name right here? You see what I mean? You don't even have respect to properly identify yourself. No, you and you won't respect. You don't have, you don't have I don't respect. give a damn. I'm not going to respect point pieces okay. like shit like... You know, auditors tend to demand respect out of everybody they encounter, but they're unwilling to give respect in turn. And the way I was raised, you got to give respect in order to get respect. I mean, uh, it goes both ways. It's a two-way street. 
both parties have to give respect in order for there to be peace. And, uh, well, you're the one who's not exactly a peaceful one right here, dude. You are not showing respect to anybody at all. These officers are being as respectful as they can be, and yet you are the one mouthing off. You are the one who's, uh, well, at the risk of uh, getting a disorderly conduct charge as well. So one has to ask, Who's really the bad guy in this situation? Is it them or is it you? Got it. It should be reciprocated. It should not be. Got it. I'm not going to respect you because you have no respect for citizens. Oh, okay. Zero. And then you threaten me. Okay. You and you are all public servants. By the way, I guarantee you it's your policy to identify yourself. So I'll check on it. Yeah, I did. And I did. I told you. You can read our names. It's all right there. How about you, sir? Identify yourself. Sure. Yeah, you too? Seems like you got a lot of cousins here, right there, right there. Everybody, uh, same name. Says Johnson, right on it. Everybody's the same name. No, mine says Johnson. Say it again. It says Johnson. How about you? You can read. Do you know how to verbalize your name? Yeah, it says on, like I said. Yeah. The only thing I heard was this right here, and then this guy's too. You also right here? Yes, sir. Yeah. So I would really like to be searching this vehicle. Good. I'm not stopping you. Your, you ass are, you are, you your ass has approached me. Your ass has harassed me. You understand that we can't do that with you. I don't give a damn. I'm not stopping you. So learn the law. Freedom of speech is not interference. Freedom of speech is not obstruction. I know. We're not. We're not <laughs> arguing your freedom of speech here. Well, then what are you arguing? We're arguing that the fact that you are endangering our scene. How? Okay. How? Standing because, on a public sidewalk, dumbass. Thank standing you. on thank a public you. sidewalk. Thank you. Don't even think thank about you. touching me. Hey, don't, don't even think. Hey. I have freedom of movement. No. Am I being detained? I'm asking you to Am move. I detained? I'm asking you Am to Am I move. detained? I'm asking you to Am I over. detained? Of, of course you're not being detained at this particular moment, you uh, complete douchebag. I mean, he's trying to get you to move a few feet in the other direction so they can have a uh, safe uh, scene right there because you never know what might happen. But of course, you frauditors like to start arguments uh, like this and create mountains out of molehill. Attitude is, don't start nothing. <laughs> Won't be nuts. Am I detained? Goodness gracious, what is your name? Am I detained? Yes or no? I don't know. You the your silence is going to be concluded as no, I'm not detained. Therefore, I have freedom if of you, movement you anywhere in this person. country, anywhere on this street, anywhere on public sidewalk, and I can say whatever the what thing I want. I can yell at you. I can speak against you. I can tell no, you, you, you are pieces of trash. Yes, you, can. you are tyrants, and there is not can. a damn not thing you can, can do. And if you I've do, asked you to I will respectfully record from over there. I don't have to obey you, or I don't have to even say, you know what? Are you requesting? I've asked you. Yes. Your request denied. Request denied. That's okay. I'm getting plenty of the footage. Don't worry about it. And it looks like it might even be a legal search. Right? No. What's the no. probable cost for search the vehicle? We don't need to talk to you. You know. What's the probable cost to search the bag? You are involved in this investigation. Oh, that's okay. It's all public now. You don't have to tell me. I can still find out. Well, dude. Let me explain something to you. When you get arrested, and especially around your vehicle, the officers can do an inventory on your vehicle. It's called an investigation, especially since, well, you've been arrested. Therefore, uh, the Fourth Amendment really doesn't uh, apply in this particular scenario. And, I mean, unreasonable searches and seizures. Uh, yeah, this is a perfectly reasonable time to do it. Now, if the guy hadn't been arrested, then yeah, it would be a Fourth Amendment violation for them to be doing this. But since he was arrested, then the circumstances change and, well, they can search the vehicle. You can't stop me from recording it. I, I never said that. I never oh, said yeah. You I your, can't record from over there. Your intimidation is already a threat. Goodness gracious. Your intimidation is already a threat. The moment you said you can, you're going to arrest me for a suction, that's a threat. No, you're good on this side, yeah? Okay. Okay. Stay on. Keep doing what you're doing. Car. Are we done with the car? We're done with the car. We're not done with the car. See? I got just in here. See? You came across somebody who is not afraid of you. 
who is not intimidated of you, who is not going to back down, who is not going to obey your unlawful orders. Got it? And your asses better learn and learn quick. But shut up, Wesley. The way the citizens had enough of this shit of yours. Threats, intimidation, violation of our rights, enough. And we are fighting back. Got it? Okay. Got it? Okay. Good. So next time you're asked to see me on the street, you better say, Sir, we are so glad you're exercising your rights, and we are going to stay out of your way, and we're going to do our thing, and that's it. Otherwise, I'm going to get in your grill, and you're going to hear me roar. Understand? Sure. Like a lion or like a tiger. And you will learn very quickly. And tigers don't roar, they hiss, but they got claws. And my claws are my voice. Understood? Yeah. 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 Keep on smirking. Okay. Keep on smirking. Okay. Un until, until shit really gets serious. And when it gets serious in the court of law, and then when it gets serious when I file complaints, it gets real serious then. Then you learn quick. Better call your lieutenant. Or probably the chief. Better get your chief out here. Yeah. Check in to, check in to see if I could be arrested. Good for you. Sheer fucking hubris. Hey, you dim-witted frauditor. Your narcissism is really showing through at this point. Did it ever occur to you that... Well, maybe they're calling a tow truck company uh, to come get this vehicle because, you know, it is creating a little bit of a hazard on the road at this point. I mean, uh, you're not it's not all about you. They're trying to do their jobs and ignore you as best as they can. But unfortunately, you had to interject yourself into this situation and uh, will annoy the living hell out of everybody because you feel like you're the top dog when you're just a tiny little kitten trying to frighten everybody with your uh, little meow. <laughs> Good for you. We'll see how that works out. <laughs> they didn't get exactly the answer you're lo looking for, huh? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Le who? The her. I hope that was your prosecutor and attorney telling you, yeah, don't touch this guy. <laughs> don't touch him. <laughs>
well, I'm just going to end the video right here, everybody. I mean, he just stands around uh, having delusions of grandeur, believing that he's the center of the universe, believing that every time they make a phone call, that it's about him. Uh, well, yeah, that's all part of his narcissistic delusions right there. I mean, in addition, it just goes to prove that most of these frauditors are nothing but a bunch of self-deluded, self-absorbed, narcissistic uh, assholes suffering from persecution complexes. And it's only going to be a matter of time before this douchebag steps into it again and, uh, well, finds himself in real trouble. And, uh, well, I can't wait for that to happen because, well, he's going to see what real trouble is. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. You don't want to go to jail. For what? You read this. Yeah. I don't have to listen to read anything. It. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not listening. Gosh. I'm not. No, sexual oriented protection. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Blah, 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fucking leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. What's the Third Amendment? Most definitely. Because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. <clears throat> that sort of thing. Well, this is what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead, uh, per the um, the uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so with that said, um, I've got too many entities. I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. Do you want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. You chose poorly. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. Also. So that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the supposed speed limit. Oh, no, I didn't tell it, you that. Yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, but I said... That's a 25. 25. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. How are you? Okay, I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave, okay? Jeff, Why? I've been calling after you. You know you're not to be on campus. No. Put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys... You are now under arrest. You guys were arresting me for nothing. No. You know you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. <laughs> Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want wa someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity.